Welcome to another video by Python Pool. In this video, we're gonna see cycle sort algorithm in Python. First of all, the question arises, what is cycle sort and how does it work? So cycle sort algorithm is an unstable sorting algorithm, which sorts your list within a cycle, but it would use a key to sort your list. That means if the, if there is a list, if I am swapping two elements according to their values, I'll use a third element as a key and I'll arrange all those three elements to their correct position. So if I'm swapping one, three and six, then while arranging one and three, I will use six as a key element and I'll accordingly, I'll sort one, three and six at their correct position. So in Python, let's see how we define code for cycle sort. First of all, I'm going to code one file name it as test.py. And once my file is ready, I'm ready to start with the function itself. I'll define my function, name it as cycle sort itself. And I'll pass the list as usual. Now, once, once my list is ready, oh, sorry, once my function is ready, I'll declare a right variable. This right would be nothing, the num nothing but the number of cycles. Now, I'm going to run the loop to find the cycle. So find the first element, second element and the key element. I'm going to run the loop for that. So for C that is cycle, cycle start in range and my range would be 0 to length of L minus 1. It is length. Length of L minus 1 because we are starting from 0 okay so would this would be my loop condition and everything would be stored in this item variable so item would have the c start index okay now i'll define one position variable which is initially equals to c start that is our cycles found the item what, where I need to put that item. Okay, so I'm going to define the loop for that one. So for for i in range and my range would be c start plus one to length of l because in item we have the c start value. So I'm going to start the loop from the next index if L of i is less than item. If it founds to be less, then I need to increase the position by one. Okay. So I need to increase the position by one and swap them. So I found that key value. Now what I'm going to do, I'm checking if I got the item and it is li got the item and it is less than the item variable itself then i'm going to check if my list is already present if in my list in my virtual memory if the object if that value is already present if pos if pos equals to equals to c star if it is already present what i need to do in this case i need to continue otherwise i need to break the loop okay and otherwise what i need to do i'm going to define one more loop for a otherwise condition so while item would be equals to equals to l of position until i got the item in the memory so in that case what i need to do i need to increase the position once again and i need to swap those because we found the item to be lesser one so i need to swap l of position and the item would be swapped. Okay. And after that, we completed one cycle. So I'm going to increase this right variable by one. Okay. Now I implemented first cycle, but I'm going to implement the remaining cycle also. That's not only in, in the one cycle, we are not going to get the sorted loop sorted array so i'm going to rotate the rest of the cycle for that again i'm going to 
implement the loop so while position is not equals to c star in this case the position was equals to c star and now position is not equals to c star in this case what is going to happen position would be equals to c star so our first condition would be satisfied and then once again i am going to run the loop so where to put the item for i in range i in range again once again c start plus 1 to end to end of the loop and sorry length, length of the l that is our end, ending position and in this case if my ally is found to be less than item once again the same procedure for the second loop so we are running basically two loop in the first loop position is equals to c start in the second loop position is not equals to c start so alternatively this loop would be followed by the list to be sorted in order to be sorted okay and once again position will be increased by one and once again i am going to run the while loop i run before i ran before while item equals to equals to l of position while we got the l of position in our memory position needs to be increased by one and once again they need to be sorted swapped l of post would be swapped by item simple swapping in python okay i got this and once again my cycle would be increased by one so we completed another cycle and once i am done with this function i am going to define my list so my list is as, as i am going to implement that one my list is 3 2 1 4 6 and 5 i am going to give comma here so it's not 14 it's 1 and 4 separately and I am going to call this cycle sort function as I am not returning anything so I am going to print this L1 itself this would be good so all our changes are made in this L1 list itself I am going to save this one I am going to run my file let's see if it works perfectly fine and yes it works perfectly fine now let's see in python how we implement this one implementation of cycle sort so this was our list 321465 first of all we got the element 3 we compare it with the sm uh, smaller elements with the elements which are smaller than 3 we compared the elements which are smaller smaller than 3 we found 1 and 2 are smaller than 3 so our basically our program would walk between 1 and 3 considering 2 as a key so it founds it founds it to be less than the item it swaps them and now my cursor jumps to once again another position that is to the 6 because i got pos plus 1 position plus 1 in the first loop and then once again i when i run second loop when i run while loop that there once again i got the position increased by 1 so i am going to jump to the 6 now i am going after jumping to the 6 with the leftover elements i am going to compare which are the elements which is less than 6 i found 4 is less than 6 5 is less than 6 but 4 is already at its correct position. So I am going to um, swap the 5 using key value as a 4. So my 4, 5, 6 would be the another cycle. So my first cycle was 1, 2, 3. Where 1 and 3 were the elements to be sorted. And 2 was the key element. In this case also, 4, 6, 5 were the another cycle. In which 6 and 5 were the elements to be sorted. And 4 was the key element. In this way, I ran my alternative loops. And the list was sort sorted so that's it from this video hope you're having a great day ahead thank you Welcome.